and blessings. I'm Pastor Brandon, and this is Leading by Faith on ACTN, The Voice. Today, we just want to read a short scripture, have a short little word and prayer with you. Today, I'm at Matthew chapter 22, verse 36, and it says this, Master, which is the great commandment in the law, or which is the greatest commandment? And Jesus said unto him, Thou shalt love thy Lord thy God with all thy heart, and with all thy soul, and with all thy mind. This is the first and great commandment. And the second one is like unto it, Thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. On these two commandments hang all the law of the prophets. Somebody came and asked Jesus. He said, what is the greatest commandment? What is the greatest thing that we can do or the law that we shall obey the most? And Jesus gave them two commandments. He said, love thy God with all thy heart, with all thy soul, and with all thy mind. And you know, the first five commandments, if you just love God and you keep him in your heart with all that you have, you will understand and you will realize that you can fulfill those first five commandments. So firstly, we have to love the second one is not so easy. It's a bit more difficult. And it tells us this, that we should love thy neighbor as thyself. I don't know about you, but some of us have some neighbors that hard to love. And a neighbor is not the person that just lives next to you. It may be the person in the cubby next to you in the office, or the person that sits next to you in school or around you or, or wherever you go. Sometimes people are hard to love. People make it hard to love them. It's not our fault, it's just hard to love. And we ourselves, we try our best to love, but we can't. But Jesus came and Jesus said this, that we can love because he first loved us. If we can't love ourselves, we can't love our neighbors. If we can't love ourselves, we can't love anybody around us. We must first learn to love ourselves. And loving ourselves, can only be revealed when we love God. Because when we love God, He can show us how to love. So uh, let's just pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this word on love. We thank you that you will teach us to love. You will make us feel love. Lord, you will keep us from loving. And oh Lord, you will you'll deliver us, oh Lord. Thank you, oh Lord, for this love that you will reveal unto us even now. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Keep viewing ACTN The Voice for more spiritually uplifting messages from the Word of God.